Hockey fans in Philadelphia seem to be split over Sarah Palin. The GOP vice presidential nominee dropped the puck at the Philadelphia Flyers home opener last night against the New York Rangers. Matt Berger is covering the McCain-Palin campaign for NBC News and the National Journal, and he's on the phone with us. So, Matt, how was it at the game last night? Hey there, Chris. Well, it seemed from my vantage point that she got a good, healthy mix of boos and cheers. Uh, there were a lot of people pointing their thumbs down, but there were also some people giving her a round of applause uh, at the Flyers game. But, you know, I talked to a couple of my colleagues who were up at the top of the stands. They said up in the cheap seats, there seemed to be more boos and applause. Let's uh, re-rack the tape if we can, because I, I want people to be able to hear exactly what happened there. Flyers fans, please welcome the best known hockey mom in the United States, accompanied by former Flyer Brian Crown. And the children of the Lowell and Piper, Governor of Alaska, Sarah Kelly. We made, we've made the point that uh, you know, hockey fans can be tough, Philadelphia fans can be tough, even Santa Claus has been booed and they threw snowballs at him. Was the campaign really surprised? It's tough to be a politician, whether you're throwing out the opening you know, day ball at baseball or you're a hockey mom doing the puck thing. You know, we kept asking them in the days beforehand, why are you doing this? You know, obviously there was a reputation about hockey fans. There was a reputation about Philadelphia. They said she's a hockey mom. She wanted to be with other hockey moms. They were really excited about it. And she seemed to be enjoying it. She said at a fundraiser earlier in the day that she was going to dress her daughter Piper in a Flyers jersey. And she hoped that would soften the blow a little bit. People might be unwilling to boo her if she was there with her eight-year-old daughter in, in a Flyers jersey. Well, so much for that. Let's talk about Sarah Palin and the traditional vice presidential role which is often a tack dog she has had some very tough things to say uh, there's been a lot of back and forth within the Republican Party about exactly how tough John McCain should be how tough Sarah Palin should be what's ahead in the coming week do we think well, you know, we saw a shift this, this week. Yesterday, Sarah Palin went out and she attacked Barack Obama, but she attacked him on his position on abortion. And that was a real difference from what we saw last week when we saw an attack on Bill Ayers and really a character attack on Barack Obama. It was an interesting difference. And I think part of this message that we're getting from McCain Palin to tone it down a little bit, we're seeing that in Sarah Palin and her choice to go after Barack Obama on policy and not on character this week. All right, Matt, 23 more days. Hang in there. I will. Thanks so much.